Hello guys, welcome back to, yes, Minecraft. I know I haven't been doing these um, videos a lot lately, and especially not Minecraft, because last time you saw me I was doing it with um, Battling Seaboy, but he's had to do some... something loud. But he's had to do... <laughs> He's had to do some stuff, um, so he hasn't had time to bring back. Well, I should bring it back. If you guys want it to be back, then comment, and I will get, bring it back because it was quite a good series. Lots of fun, lots of stuff. But the main reason why I am going on here is to show you guys the new tutorial world. Um, to actually experience it myself, because I don't actually know much about this. I know there's new biomes and items and stuff, but I'm not actually sure which these all are, so a lot of consider the new biomes. There's a giant cathedral thing, which looks really awesome. Create new world. Let's put it on creative. I just want to fly around. So look at that little box, look at that little box. Lots of items. Wow, that's kind of cool. That is a disco. Disco. Nice. Never gonna beat box again because that was awful. Oh, there's thick trees. <laughs> no one else is thick. The the branches, obviously. Don't think of anything else but branches. <laughs> It always takes too long, too long to log in and work because it's really big. It's a big game. <sighs> oh, so is this the tutorial? Do I just start in the middle of nowhere? Oh no, I didn't. Oh, I didn't select the tutorial. God damn it! What a load of baloney. Well, I'll be back. I actually selected the wrong thing. I didn't actually select tutorial. Just created a new world. Okay, 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 here we go. Right, so apparently you can actually make these blocks. I'm not sure how, but I shall find out with a... First, first of all, um, we got new sand, which is like a kind of an orangey beigey, red sandy colour. It's not really red, it's kind of orange, but they call it red. So it's basically the same, but it's obviously, yeah, it's red. Um, so they've got acacia wood, I believe, yep, that's acacia wood. they got dark, dark, dark oak, they got... So basically they just got different kind of woods. This, the acacia wood is kind of for the savannah, so it's going to be kind of like savannah-y, doesn't it? And the trees are really oddly shaped, they're like they always kind of verge off either to the left or right or left up or down. And it's kind of weird and peculiar. This was a different kind of dirt, like all these blocks like the sea lantern, the um, prismine, the dark prismine, prismine bricks and sl uh, slime box stuff. But those ones are for the underwater, um, what's it called, the underwater fountain. <laughs> Oops. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, one was rogue. Um, so, is everything's basically brand new? My cat, even my cat's brand new. <laughs> Shh. Right, so, um, so as well as all those things I was talking about, uh, so there's like Sea Temple, which has um, these guardians and stuff in them. And th these are basically the block blocks. What are you doing? What are you doing, eh? <laughs> and these are basically the blocks that um, build it. And it's pretty cool. So they got they got more saplings, so they got dark oak. There's obviously new trees. There's a whole... <laughs> He's trying to drop to me. Uh, there's a whole different variety of um, flowers. They're quite actually nice. One of the flowers, this one, this flower, the lilac. Yep, the lilac. If you place the lilac on the floor and you apply a, I'm trying to find it now, a bone mill, bone mill somewhere, somewhere is bone mill. I forgot what things are. This is very embarrassing. Oh, there it is. 
if you get one of these and you place it, you can get endless supply of flowers. So that is quite fancy. I don't know where I'm actually going. There's a farm somewhere which shows you something magical, which is pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. If you go to... So they got... Excuse me. They got new animals. The new animals are, in fact, bunny rabbits. Bunny rabbits are really cute and fluffy. They're supposed to spawn... This is adorable. They're supposed to spawn wild, but I haven't actually found a wild one yet. But I shall be trying to find a wild one, because wild ones are quite cool, in a way. So yeah, there's not much that has actually changed apart from the blocks and obvious and different things are made. There's different um, villages as well. So you've got the like librarian. You used to have a farmer, librarian, uh, butcher, blacksmith, and cleric. But now you get like a farmer, fisherman, butcher, meat chopper or something. So look, he's a butcher, and this guy is a butcher as well. See, what I just said just didn't make any sense, but there's many different... What was this? Oh, look, there's new doors. Nice. So there's many different guys. So there's like a farmer, there's a fisherman. Um, this is a pretty nice place over here. Look at that, all that detail. I could try and make something like this, but it's going to probably take me a long time to build this, because this is a like a cathedral. It's really nice and I like it. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god, it's an Enderman. He's <laughs> like, no, I'm not. I'm not an Enderman. Oh, he's hiding in the corner. It's alright. So this actually is a pretty nicely architectural design. I quite like it. See, so, look. He's the armoured. He's the armoured officers. There's a see look leather work. He's the same as the butcher because there's leather work in the butcher. They're wearing the same outfit and a tall smith, and then he was an armored um, guy. So they're, they're all different kind of ones. I don't know. They have different names. You used to get like six people at first, but now you get I don't know twelve, fifteen, twelve or fifteen guys. So yeah, there's actually a disc over there. I'm not sure how it's supposed to get over there. I'm going to try and parkour it. All at the end of my life looking at me, he's like, you can do it, brother. <laughs> oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> oh, damn it, I didn't even jump. But anyway, so yeah, I'm not sure how you're supposed to get over here, but this is the organ, and there is a disc behind the organ. So I'm going to take that. I'm just going to break the chest. One of 12 discs. Nice. So this is the cathedral. It's quite a nice place, actually. I like it, what they've done. <laughs> it can't even be asked to open doors like broken doors break it so yeah for some reason they have random fire pits there's nothing below it it's just a random fire pit I couldn't find anything it probably is like really far down or something but they made a golf course for some reason the golf course is pretty cool I do admit I can't help you I just woke up <laughs> but basically they just got different coloured thing I don't even know it's supposed to play it you can't play it basically it's not even 18 holes, there's like 6. I believe there's like 6. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, there is 6, that was a good guess. I think there's a random thing you can fly through. <laughs> I'm not even sure why that's there. It's probably something... Um, it, wait, yeah, I think that's um, some place in real life. So yeah, this is the uh, basically the orangey, sandy, red sand, orange stuff. Um, it looks pretty nice. It kind of looks like cheese, like that orange cheese you get. Probably a really weird way to explain, it, actually. But yeah, it's like orange cheese. But it looks actually quite nice. They've also got various amounts of these. There's quite a lot of creepers there. But anyway, they got um, got four lighthouses. I'm not sure what this is. Pistons, but pistons for what? I don't understand. It probably just makes it look nice. Oh, it does actually look nice, but you understand what I mean. Is there a chest up here, actually? No, so I'm wondering if there is a chest. I just ruined it for you guys. Oh, there's another another bridge. Um, so, yep, this these are also 
uh, biomes that spawn um, without you doing anything. So this is a clay biome. I'm not sure exactly what it's called. I've just like, slandered everything. I don't even know what it's called. But it's different colours of clay that are placed. Still doesn't go with a golden helmet, but anyway. So it's different types of clay like built into one giant mountain of clayness. So if you want to find another um, disc as well, you just go down here. Damn it, I will try to time that perfectly. It's not that hard to find one. You go down here and you found a chest. And then the chest has a cute disc in it. So that's two discs. And you just go up here. Break through, come and stay, do your stuff. Yeah, this place, I admit, this place is amazing. This is so cool. It's maybe maybe in ruins, but if you've got the time and patience, this is a real place. In Scotland, I believe. That's where 4J is. Oh, there's a chest. I didn't see this chest. So it's it's 4J is based in Scotland. So this is meant to be one of their buildings they have there. Also, I was told I might get that wrong. I do apologise if I have got that wrong. But it's basically really cool. You got broken pillars outside. Random square. It's actually pretty cool. What I've actually done with this. Is this the one? No, this is not the one. See, they've, they've reversed the daylight sensor as well. So, this place is pretty cool. This is a giant mansion with a giant maze. I actually figured out how to do this. Um, I'll quickly try and run through this. Oh, I'm just going to rage quit. Oh, you made a mistake. Um, so, basically, I actually rather enjoy what they have done with this game. They've added a lot more textures. or well, not more textures, like blocks. So, I can actually, in my world where I'm building my castle, I can interpret some of these blocks within it and start building better things. So, with the sands, I can obviously build... Oh, stop yawning me. I can actually build some of the um some of the things that I'm thinking thing. <laughs> I can actually build some of my buildings with the red sandstone and with some of the other things because it looks pretty cool. Red sandstone does look quite cool. I wouldn't say it's red or say it's like an orange, but it's given the name red sandstone. Oh, there's another pole. It's the final pole. I'm almost there. So if you follow my guide, like, specifically, you will find the chest at the end of the maze. But don't get stuck on the wall like I did. It's not a part of the plan. And there you go. You have found the fourth... Disc, I forgot what they were called. Yeah, when I saw this, this is um the oh, what's it called? Big tree biome. There you go. <laughs> I totally forgot what the names are. This is really, really saddening me. I feel every day. Yeah, these spawn naturally. Like all of them spawn naturally. I can't even climb a tree. Climb a tree. Oh, just fly up. Get in. Get in. This is. I thought this was um. Because, yeah, I thought this was El Ewok home of the Star Wars because of the newly released Star Wars The Force Awakens that came out two days ago. But apparently it's not. Well, it might be, but I'm not actually quite sure if it is or not. It does look pretty cool. It might just be a kind of a fitness course where you gotta jump around. This is, oh my god, I'm going to try this one. <laughs> well, you got to jump around and try and make your way across this to see how good your parkour and skills are. What a pretty good kind of, I guess... No, they're terrible. But, yeah, I thought it was an Ewok's home. Because it's got the big trees and it's got the... See how they all spawn, actually. It's the big trees and all the wood. It just makes it seem like an Ewok's house. But then it also seems like a very cool place. <laughs> like an 
adventure area. See, look, you gotta just to slide up. Let it go across there, go up there, jump up, parkour skills to the max, and then get up. And then that's it's solid, adventurous, and difficult and spooky. But yeah, that's pretty cool. I gotta remember where the undersea temple is because that place is somewhere, but I can't remember. Um, but awesome here, there is a uh, sh sharded Iceland, spiked Iceland, sharp Iceland or something. But there, there's massive pieces of ice and snow blocks you can place now. You can place snow blocks. You can actually create snow blocks. So they've just got tons of sharp ice placed in snowy areas. Here's the one. That's what I was talking about. There's a chest here. Don't need that. Don't need that. Did I pick up the disc? There's supposed to be a disc in there. Oh. So, yeah, there's a disc in that one. But I dropped it somewhere. I believe I dropped it. Anyway, but that'll be number five. My cat is being so annoying. This is this is there's nothing new about this. You know the, um, in the previous update with that house, this is basically not a castle. This is the castle that was basically at the beginning. So it's exactly the same format and layout as before. So nothing has really changed. I never actually noticed that. That is so cool. That's really cool. Oh, back to the computer. Computer? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 something over there. This is a mushroom biome. Don't try parkour in that, you can't. It's it's impossible. You kind of get to the first, like, six, and then you fall off. Uh, so, yeah, this, they have actually extended the, um, pri <laughs> the pri amateur, the premises, of the nether portals, the biggest I believe you can build a nether portal now is 27, no, 23 by 23 blocks. So that's huge. You can have like a giant building with a whole wall of purple fuzzy stuff. <laughs> I think this was kind of pointless. Okay, <laughs> this is a random house. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Can you just build a giant never portal? But um, it doesn't. It doesn't turn out to be a giant never portal when you play it. So when you go into the never, the portal is the same size as it normally would be. Uh, water breathing. Is this what I need? I need uh, I'm gonna try and find that place. Uh, strength. Night vision, there we go. Boom. Right. So we're just gonna quickly dash around the map to try and find the underwater temple. So I can't actually remember where it's placed. So if you if you actually got a new world and you want to go and you find uh, gravel placed across the floor, this actually is deep sea, and as you can see, deep sea is where temples spawn. Uh, here are the, here are the new mobs. They are not sure what they're called. They are so scary. They are actually, what's he doing? He's like protecting him. Well, was, okay, this is kind of scary. Uh, they're all protecting themselves. The guardians, there is normally one here. They are like much bigger than those. They're much bigger than these guys. Uh, let's see if I can find a guardian. Oh my god, it's so slow underwater. I'm gonna fly. Wait. How do I even. Okay, I'm inside one of the the 
There's different sounds as well. I think they're the mobs making those noises. Oop, oop. So, there are guardians. Where are the guardians? There's giant cheese, apparently. More giant cheese. I'm actually lost. I don't even know where the guardians are. I must have just spawned one. Because they are supposed to spawn one in there, one in there, and one at the top. But they don't seem to have any spawn. Oh wow, this place is new. There he is! That's one of the... Basically one of the bosses in this place. They are super hard to kill. And when you hit them they kind of get annoyed. But of uh, course they won't attack me because I'm in god mode. And... Well, creative. So it means there should be one... On this side. Somewhere. There should, there should be one on this side as well, but there isn't. This is why I couldn't find it, because I wasn't in the other side, I was in this side. Just destroying the whole temple. So there's, a, there's one in there. There should always be one on the top, my vision is going. There's the big one in top. So there's one big guy in the top, and then there's two little guys on each side. So if you kill all three of these, basically that's like you get something. I'm not sure what you get, but if you kill all three of them, then you get something. So that's what the temple looks like. Very snazzy. What was it? So yeah, they, yeah, as you just probably saw, or you probably did. But these guys shoot lasers. Yes, I said that right. They shoot lasers to attack you. I'll try and show you quickly that they shoot lasers. So we want to spawn. I'll just spawn a witch. No one's going to attack you. When you oh, okay. Prob probably mobs don't attack mobs. So I'm going to try and spawn a purple. Where's the brown? Where's the brown egg? There's the brown egg. Spawn a villager. Nobody's attacking. No one's attacking. Okay. Why do I get the guy's big tail? <laughs> See, they do shoot lasers, but they're not actually showing you that they shoot lasers. See, they killed the squid. <laughs> they just don't even care. They're just like, yep, yeah, it's going to float around. But anyway, so I oh, didn't actually show you the savannah. I can't find the savannah either. It's these places are just. That elude me. See, it does actually look like some place out of Star Wars movie, which is awesome. Gonna protect the castle. Protecting the castle from any mobs that want to attack. <laughs> it actually kind of, it kind of works, but it kind of doesn't because one of the bits do overlap. So basically, it's like a giant wall shrouding everything. <laughs> it's like perfect position, just to protect it. Um, and yeah, I've actually shown you guys everything apart from the savannah but i shall probably show you in a later episode probably carry on doing minecraft again um and basically oh, oh, there's a chest number five so i found five of them i can't actually find very much of this <laughs> probably do another video on 12 discs as well for you guys to find them all um and as always thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to leave a like comment and most of all subscribe i will see you guys in the next episode stay awesome
Thank <laughs> you.